Well, Jeannie McBride following the storm as well. Been out on the roadways uh, right in Rochester. Joining us live from Brighton now here in our second half hour. All right, Jeannie. Uh, well, it looks pretty much there like it did in Rochester. Just a lot of snow you're dealing with. Yeah, taking a little tour around the area, but it, exactly, it looks the same. A uh, lot, lot of snow. And if you want to, we're going to take a look over here. Our good pal John uh, is plowing this uh, parking lot driveway here in Brighton. He told me that he already plowed this back around 3 a.m. And now he's right back at it. It looks like it hasn't actually been plowed before it. Hey, John, wait to the camera. There we go. You're great. All right. So besides John, earlier today when we were outside, we saw one of the most... Oh, well, just props to her. She was skiing today. Her name is Zoe. And uh, I, I was wondering why she was out there. Uh, take a listen to what she said. I just woke up. and uh, I mean, I've seen all the snow and everything, so I want to go out skiing. So I haven't skied in years, but I just got my skis waxed, so it's the perfect time. props to her. She is a trooper. But again, you know, as we've been saying, the snow is coming down. Roads are very slick. Uh, so make sure that you stay inside and just uh, enjoy the warmth and, and don't be out here. It's really cold. But all right, Mark, back to you. Jeannie, thank you. Skis might be the right way to go with all that uh, snow packed on the roadways. Uh, appreciate uh, your coverage this morning. Our